Hey guys, welcome back to Three Phase Innovations. Today we're going to be working on a 243 phase service with a 12240 single phase service. Keep in mind this bank also has a 208 high leg. Why is that important? We need to know where that high leg is because if we were ever to change a bank of transformers out for any reason, we need to know where that is because we don't want to put 208 volts on a 120 circuit. If that happens, we're going to burn everything up on that circuit. So. Today we're going to kind of look at the transformer bank, see where the ground position is between the phases on the transformer, and identify that. Uh, right now, we're looking at, first of all, let's get it like this. A phase is red, B phase is yellow, C phase is blue. We go up here to our transformers, B and C, center transformer, is grounded. So from this point, Ground 120, C on the other side to ground 120. A comes all the way around here on the back side. So the distance for A all the way to a ground is going to put us right at 208 volts. Right now we're going to test it. So A with the furthest phase away from the ground, 210 approximately. That's good. B phase, 119. C phase, 120. These voltages do vary a little bit. These are no load transformers. But right now we're going to de-energize it, move the ground, and show you how that high leg can be easily shifted. Right now we're taking it from B to C. We're going to take it over here between A and B. So A and B to ground are going to be 120. C, because we're traveling three coils away, it's going to put us at 208. Re-energize, C phase. 207, B phase to ground. 120, A phase to ground. 122, phase to phase. 244, 243, B to C, 239, and A to C, 240. Again, this is just to let you be aware of that 208 high leg. You always need to be aware of that whenever you're reconnecting this to this bank. Mark it, put it over the side, and then we'll mix it back into the rotation correctly. Thanks again for watching Three Phase Innovations. Check us out.